We have set sail from Lot and found a floating casino on the sea. I don't know much about gambling, but I know about destiny. And I, Gillian Tidestrider, am going all in on number seven, for it is my destiny to win big in roulette. Go forth, my gamble balls, and just roll with it. Welcome back to Just Roll With It. I'm Grizzly, your mm, DM. Can't swear in the beginning for a minute. <laughs> I'm Bizzly and I play Chip. I'm Condi and I play Jay. I'm Charlie. You may know me as Slimesicle or maybe you know me as Gillian Tide Strider. Doubt it. You guys ready to gamble? <laughs> yeah. yeah, I'm ready to lose right. it all, baby. Okay. I'm ready to risk Please it all. I'm ready money. to lose it all. Charlie, okay. Charlie, can you lend me like a hundred bucks today? I, you know, I just don't have the money for this gambling thing. Okay, I'll get you. I, I'll pay you back, You'll man. Pay you know, like back? My, You'll pay I, me I, back. I remortgaged my house. Okay, because my my, and I lost my, friend, that already. my neighbor was actually <laughs> saying you asked him the same question, and he hasn't oh, seen yeah, you around no, a bit. Oh yeah, I also, <laughs> yeah, you know, I, I moved away, um, because because he was looking for me so much, and I, it made me very uncomfortable. Tell you what, I'll do you better than giving you a hundred mm -hmm. bucks. Here's this yep. kit of essential oils. All right. Oh. If you <laughs> if you can get three of your friends, <laughs> start the fucking episode. <laughs> yeah, I just want to let you guys know: if you do lose money in the game, you do lose it in real life. Go check out our Patreon. Ominous. We're gonna need it after this one. <laughs> Where we last left off, the three of you, Chip, Jay, and Gillian, celebrated freeing the island of Luff and Lot from its curse of perpetual laughter. After a massive party spanning across the entire town, you were rewarded with a brand new ship and once again set out to continue your pirating life on the high seas. During your travels, mail was delivered by the Dolphin Postal Service, and from the news pamphlets you learned that you were all now wanted pirates and were given bounties to be captured. On one of the wanted posters delivered Someone with the news, wants us. <laughs> you learned of some other pirates, one of them being worth much more than the rest of you. After a few nights and days of peaceful travel, and some high stakes chess games, Jay experienced a chain of night terrors that left her less than well rested. On this evening, where your ship crossed paths with an extravagant attraction here in the Royal Ocean, you all ran to the ends of the ship, gazing your eyes on a structure of gold, a narrow drawbridge extended from its entrance, lights illuminating the sides as if it were laying out the red carpet for you all. And that, is where we pick back up for this episode. Oh, let's fucking go! Woo! So I'm ready. I'm excited. Chip grabs all of your money from the <laughs> from the bottom. From wait, the bottom wait, did deck. he grab all of our money or just Yo, his I, money? Oh no, I grabbed as much money as I could possibly fit into my pockets, pants, underwear, wherever I could put that shit. It is, and it is falling out as I run into. Onto I'll the help ship. him. I'll help him. <laughs> we'll sail faster without it. <laughs> all right. So as you all run down this runway, uh, you see two more bright signs light up under the large casino sign in sync with the sounds of drums and brass instruments coming from inside this building. One that says blue and the other saying Royale. Approaching the front entrance, you look up and you can't see past the tall silver doors that are reflecting the different colored lights that wrap around this building, and it gives the door this prismatic appearance. You guys go to reach for the knobs, but you come to an impasse with a lot like a muscular arm and a black suit. And you guys notice there's a bouncer on each side, both having humanoid bodies, but large shark heads oh, with <laughs> dark pointed shades on the snout. The one that reaches arm out says, No way, Jose! Can't enter in those threads! And then he points to a side entrance with a large sign that says dress. Like giving us free I'm, clothing? I think I'm dressed fine. It's no, always on the house, the other one says. <laughs> your, your ice is it's it's melted. You're not dripping anymore. Oh no, I use shape water dripping. to create him to create him new ice. <laughs> <laughs> sure, whatever, man. Sick. <laughs> what do you okay. guys do? Keep it frosty. I create um, it. Yeah, I create him a sick Rolex out of ice. Okay. How about now? Do I? Am I? Am I rocking it? Yeah. He looks. Yeah, I got the watch. He looks you up and down with the with the white shirt, black suspenders. Nope. <laughs> 
Check the okay. time, Chip. It's time to win it all. All right. It says that, that on the watch. It's just says, it just says it. <laughs> <laughs> At that point, I'll go into the little uh, the little room, yeah. the little side entrance. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I go in there. I look for threads. I'm looking for some for some threads. Okay. Oh, threads. Fresh. Yeah. I only see whole clothes. You guys walk into this room. It's like a giant walk-in closet that that stretches from from the entrance all the way down to the other side, like the front end of the boat. It's it's huge. It's just two like walls of clothing that you guys can pick from and literally put together whatever you want. But it's all fancy okay. uh, dress dress up like suits, leather, blah blah blah. You know, like the fancy attire. Mm -hmm. okay. We have a montage. <laughs> montage. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, do so you okay, guys want okay. to describe Here's your what... montage at all? Help each other out. I want like I want Gillian to be walking out in different like strange tribal clothes, and it's just Chip <laughs> and Jay sitting back like nodding. Le this like... is the ceremonial <laughs> dress of my people. <laughs> yeah, that's I don't know offensive. if that's gonna work here. I'm just I'm just drenched. Got like fucking just sea stars <laughs> sucking on me. <laughs> All right. No, how about, I think how about something this? more like this. Oh, and we pull out two completely different things. <laughs> what do you have? <laughs> I have like a regular. I suit pull out a kelp tie. G string. What do you pull out? <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> I want to. I want to pull out one of those shirts that's really big and it looks like it's like a bikini. It's a leotard of seaweed. <laughs> <laughs> there's so many so many seaweed based clothing it's, it's weird <laughs> I, I pull out fucking sea star nipple tassels throw them out <laughs> I, um, and then finally and then finally I come out in my in my final suit uh, to see what they have to think about it it's this kind of like it almost looks like it, it's this royal blue with some white accents it's got those little poofies with that kind of the the flare to it uh it's cuffed off and it has gold embellishments on the end as you see this flowing cape as well as across uh the vest that it has and these different golden buttons mm. yeah how is this wow yeah, that looks I... great Thank actually work. yeah look, look <laughs> longingly at the, at the kelp g-string and if it bring your head away what, from it if it is what is normal here then it is what i will I will do. So as you guys uh, finally help Gillian uh, put on his outfit, the three of you in, in some strange slow motion burst the doors open and walk in unison towards the, the big silver doors. What are doors. they wearing? What, what are, are the wearing? others? What are you guys wearing as you okay. walk together into uh, the entrance? Bizzle, so, go ahead first. Yeah, yeah. So Chip is going to step out looking looking mighty dapper he's wearing a, he's wearing a full suit that's a light blue with these like orange little goldfish all over it and it's got these different <laughs> wave patterns all over it the same pattern on the tie and he's and he's just he's just dripping he's got that he's got that ice an ice watch he's got an <laughs> ice, ice chain watch. he's looking it's good. like he's looking, looking at the, it's like looking at the sun and his and his hair is like gelled back man built like an iceberg <laughs> that sunk the titanic <laughs> What about it's, Jay? It's such a, it's so busy, Jay I feel out, like my um, eyes can't render it. <laughs> <laughs> so she's got a dress on um, that she's got kind of like the whole, the frills all the way down to her about forearm mm -hmm. right around here. Um, and not covering shoulders. Uh, it's a nice deep red, kind of sparkly kind of deal Ooh. with a little um, mid, there's like a mid part halfway down the dress that is like a darker red, very glittery um, with some kind of golden ornaments around it. Um, and the frills on the bottom of the dress are a more golden as well. Right on. And she's in high heels. Fuck yeah. You know, we're going with it. <laughs> if my people Ooh. saw me, they would fully disown me. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's hope we don't so see him in here. <laughs> okay, so. Coming into the casino. All of your senses feel an immediate rush of excitement and extravaganza with a fruity, gingery smell that just surrounds all of you. The shape of the interior <laughs> is hexagonal with not a single inch of empty space in any direction that you look. It's seemingly split, split into sections of different attractions, but currently you three stand at the entrance on the red carpet that cuts down the middle of the entire room. At the very end, passing a circular receptionist counter in the center, you see an elevator. You have a split second to take all of this in before hearing a loud cheer nearby, noticing a huge crowd surrounding an ongoing gamble. What's going on over there? 
what the what is happening? <laughs> it's a it's a it's a big rush. <laughs> <and> shock. Then, <laughs> woo, you hear from a distance? A Gil, bunch of it's people. a casino. It's got to be someone gambling. Wait, Gil, over there. have you ever gambled before, Gil? My my life many times against villains. Is this similar? No, I mean, no, this kinda, is money. But yeah, money. I use yeah, uh, I use divine sense to see if there's any good or evil in this casino. <laughs> <laughs> DM, okay. it's time for you to tell the audience if gambling is subjectively <laughs> evil or not. <laughs> okay. What is it? What, what vibes? You're looking around and you and you cast a vine sense to see if there's any good or I evil. I've heard of the evil of gambling. You see, you see many uh, different humanoid figures, all of them having, uh, at least the employees, the ones that are wearing like these sparkling red and pink and blue leotards with feathers on the on the ends of their arms, except they all have like different aquatic animal heads. And so it's a Let's bit go. jarring at first, but to you it doesn't matter. I'm into it. I'm yep. into it. Uh, you don't sense anything from any of the people in here, any kind of evil. Six. You just get little blips of that energy from some of the machines and attractions that are <laughs> nearby. <laughs> That's funny. So what do you guys do? Do you head towards that crowd? Yeah. Mm, I'd like to, yeah. I'm Sounds gonna put exciting. my arm around around Gil's shoulder and say, All right, watch closely what this guy's doing. So we're gonna do that. I want to take his hand like a toddler. <laughs> <laughs> okay, like lightly, lightly grip his hand and fucking looking around. <laughs> okay. It's all right, buddy. I know it's a lot to take in. So much stimuli. You've seen you've seen shows from where you're from, Gillian, but this is just on a different whole different man. level. I'm in it. I'm in it now. All right. You head towards uh, the crowd that had that um that had that loud cheer nearby. Uh, you make your way through and you see another humanoid figure behind uh, a half circular table with a green top, this time with a large fish head, just a normal fish head, it's blue in color, uh, and he wears a black vest over fancy attire. And on the other side of this table, arms on the on the table, leaning forward with the palm, you know, like the hands together. Oh. Ram Bronboo! Hi! Let's go! <laughs> if you'd like to introduce and describe your character, this is where you are. Ah, uh, so you see a, a dragonborn, a very, very tall dragonborn. You see him wearing a pink suit that seems that it was made bigger as because it was usually a size small, but it's in fact been enlarged with just a lot of patches everywhere. You can see that he came in, <laughs> you, he came in, he's wearing it over his clothes, which means that he probably came in very poor, but is now extremely rich due to, well, <laughs> gambling. <laughs> oh my god. Holy shit. Uh, it seems like he has not left that chair for, well, hours. <laughs> Surrounding he's just, him are, he's just simmering. are different. Does uh, he have an odor? Is there an odor coming from him in any way? Don't ask. It's important to know. I'm trying to get in the scene, man. I mean, I mean, you can definitely smell something. I mean, he has been sitting in the chair for quite a while. It's I, I, I smell victory in the air. <laughs> no, I think that's just that guy. It smells like luck. <laughs> Surrounding him are, are are tons of people. He's got like uh two of these these uh female with with uh, fish heads of course um on, on like both sides of the shoulder leaning in and like like kissing the dice uh actually in the middle of the game right now is what you is where you are uh would you like to say your name of your character uh yes yes my name is clorton okay <laughs> let's go clorton! I, like clorton. To, I like to imagine that he just said it out loud <laughs> my name is clorton I'm you gonna take all your money. are in the middle of uh <laughs> dice based blackjack and you have won repeatedly, like over twenty times in a row in the last few Holy hours. Shit. This is uh, this is this is the uh, this is currently a, a very large bet. You've om it's not close to going all in, but it's if you win this, it's gonna triple your uh, your current amount of chips and gold next to you. So go ahead and roll a d4 and a d6 for me. All right, all right. <laughs> Lose it all. Let's do this thing. Lose it all. Lose it all. D6 first roll, and D4. first roll of the episode, Let's man. Do Let's this. see. <laughs> Wait, is that okay. good? That's actually right. not bad. You got two fours. That doesn't too bad, right? Okay. With the way that this game works, in particular, uh, I don't know if you guys have ever played blackjack, but for this one uh, specifically, you want to roll a D6 and a D4, and uh, you want to get close to having a total of ten greater than the dealer's hand. He also rolls. He only rolls the d6 uh, in front of you, where you can see it, which I roll right now. 
and he keeps his d4 hidden. Oh shit. From you. Ooh. So you want to get close to 10. Oh. <laughs> as close to 10 as possible while also having a uh, a higher um basically oh, you just want to have, have a higher roll. Gambling? You have a, you want to have so, a higher total than the dealer. 10 in this case okay. is the 21 that you'd have in jet blackjack, right? Yes. Okay. That is right. I've never, I've never gambled before. I don't know. Gillian is usually pretty moist, but now more so. You more can either it. choose to stand <laughs> with your uh, your number that you rolled at first, or you can hit with a D4, okay. basically rolling okay. a D4 to raise the total. Uh, the dealer okay. rolled a five, right? Out there. Mm. That's what you see. Yeah. You, you see that he rolled a five with his mm. D6, but you don't know what the other number is. What, what a battle is this? Do you stand? I'll stay. I'll stay. Okay. Smart play. I'll stand. <laughs> The dealer from behind his back shows the D4 in his hand and opens it up, and you see that his total only equaled seven. Oh! 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 Cheer as you have again won against this dealer, and he just ah. says, "That luck is untouchable, baby." From that fish head. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, how many times has this guy won in a row now? I don't know, but I think we should take his chips. As uh, I think so too. As the uh, the crowd erupts in a cheer, uh, you see a, a waitress start to approach. She's got this this very skin tight red sparkling dress on, uh, with fishnets on the human legs, and her head is of humanoid nature. Uh, but her her hair instead of being you know locks of uh, uh, like threads of hair, it's just a very large glowing red, blue, and orange jellyfish that kind of takes the place. That's cool. She has this uh, giant tray of, uh, of of these drinks that have little lobster tails hanging off the side of the glass, and she puts it in the middle of uh, the whole crowd and says, "Darlings, I have refreshments on the house, of course." And you just see people to start grabbing them, uh, most likely including. They are, they are on the Ronda. table, but I will take <laughs> them. Uh, yes. I don't break eye contact with with uh, Clorton's chips, and I just grab one and I start sipping and plotting. <laughs> okay. Clorton, you would know this to be the famous uh, lobster cocktail. Lobster cocktail. <laughs> take the lobster <laughs> eat <all>. Take it in. <laughs> so Chip grabs one, starts drinking one about Jay and uh, and and Gillian and, and Clorton. Of course, you have a choice. Somewhat. You just feel like you really like this and you want to. I'm gonna not drink. No. I'm gonna. Yeah. I take a whole. I take the lobster tail off one of the drinks and just full like a full eat it. Okay. <laughs> are you crunching just, everything? Are you crunching the, the <laughs> tail? Yeah. I just crunch the whole thing. But get, Yo, come dude, on, you're not so supposed to eat the tail. Perhaps I'll have another. It's very good. <laughs> <laughs> you're supposed to drink it. Oh no. Actually, you know Real. what? Keep doing what you're doing. <laughs> Jay, you said you're not so gonna we, drink one. Yeah, I'm not gonna drink one. Bro, the jacket is already killing me. I'm already dying. <laughs> I gotta, I gotta submit. I'm sorry. We lost one. Oh, oh man. I'm not strong enough. All right. We'll carry should on. We, should we speak it. with this champion of this casino? Mm, I don't know. I mean, we could speak okay. to him, or you could speak to him, and when his back's turned. Sounds Just good. Sneaky. I walk over. I walk over. To, can... I walk over to Clorton. Oh no! <laughs> I want to. I walk behind the other way. Oh no! <laughs> I'm gonna accidentally scam him. <laughs> <laughs> Fellow champion, my name is Gillian Tidestrider. What are these glory discs? I look over at the chips. The more you have, the more money you have, and the more people just crowd around you for some I reason. I see. Okay. I see. Hi. Fighting for glory and fame, mm -hmm. I can respect it. I mean, not really glory or fame, pretty much just money. Just money, really. The red-dressed woman uh, waitress that, that comes up to you, Jay, and says, Come on, darling, are you that scared to turn down a free drink? She just no, hands you a like glass. I feel like should be sober for today, you know? I, oh, that's no way to have fun years. in a place oh. where you just take risks and let loose. How about I take some risks and then I drink when I feel better about the risks I'm taking? I eat another lobster. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna sit down at the, the blackjack chips. table. I want to take his chips while he's talking to Gillian. I really want to take like at least like a handful. All right, slide, make a slide of hand check. Okay. And uh, and um, Clorton, make 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 a perception check against his slide of hand. Okay. Okay. Oh. That's a four. <laughs> that is that is a four. You don't see that. You don't see it. 
<laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah, Chip is um. I, I see you are a sharer. Oh, what, what, does that, what does that mean? I'm a, I'm a sharer? It's very generous of you. Very generous of you. To share the chips with my friend, Chip. I look up. Hey! Wait, what, what, are you, what are you doing over there? <laughs> what? Oh, nothing. I'm just sitting here drinking my drink. Nothing that's else. not nearly... That's okay. not at all what he sounds like, by the way. <laughs> Killing a chip. He's doing something. All right, fine. I throw him back out on the table. Wow, you gave in incredibly easily, actually. Yeah, Home you, run. You really just did not try to keep the chips that you stole, huh? I mean, so who just who I just gonna... won? Who just won that? I think I, I think I, I just won, won that actually. Yeah, yeah. Won. I am beginning to understand gambling. <laughs> you should try it. I mean, it's pretty fun. I mean, I've been winning a lot, so I mean, it's obvious that you can probably really? win as well. Yeah, you yeah really so think you, you're so? not. I think I think so, honestly. If you have no idea what you're doing, that makes it ten times easier. So you're not doing anything, like you're just playing the game normally? I am rolling and figuring things out as I go, honestly. I sat down at this table not knowing what I'm doing, and I'm going to leave this table not knowing what I'm doing. That That's the spirit, meta. maybe the dealer says <laughs> as you sit down. <laughs> Jay, you said you sit so down you at do? the blackjack table? Yeah, I'm going to sit Dude, down. Dude, I'm, I'm in. I'm fucking into this. Yeah, absolutely. Okay. Well, so, uh... If I suppose it is my destiny... <laughs> <laughs> uh, I will say one one at a time. Uh, one at a time, you can play against the dealer, but it's a 10 GP buy-in. So if you want to play, baby, you gotta pay, baby. <laughs> 10 gold pieces or 10 chips. I'm gonna... I want to go in. I'm feeling the game on the spear today. I'm going at 100 gold. <laughs> All right, so you, oh, guys see, <laughs> you guys see Jay just take a plop right down on the stool where, uh, where Clorton was at first. Roll a D6 and a D4. Check out this. This is gonna be awesome. Worried for you. That's that's a six. Five plus one. Ooh. Mm. That's exactly like right where in the I middle, want. Man. That's, that's like right, right where I want to be. That's right Clorton where I want to this, be. Clorton is this good? The dealer or rolls. Or the dots uh, good? Uh, I don't think so. The dealer rolls a d6 down his arm and it just kind of uh, gently Ooh. rolls off the tips of his fingers and onto the table. Looks really cool. Oh my god, he's so cool. And you see that he rolls a three. Okay. I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna roll again. I'm gonna roll the dice. You're gonna hit? See right, what it's a, it's a, yeah, it's a D4. Me. Oh, this sucks. <laughs> oh. I got a one. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh. That brings your uh, your total up to seven? Yes. I think I can hit one more time, technically, if it's by same blackjack rules. I'm pretty sure you can hit as much as you want, but if you go over you're 10, right. you bust. Hit until <laughs> victory is achieved. <laughs> the enemy so, lies you're defeated. You're so right, Gil. You see the dealer roll behind him as if to hit as well. Okay, I hit again. I got a two. So we're at nine? So that's nine total. Yeah. That's that's good, right? Yeah, I'm chilling there. I'm chilling. I'm that's staying good. there. Yeah, yeah. Hit again, hit again. No, what? Are you crazy? You're staying? Do it. I'm staying. No, don't do it. The dealer reveals that he rolled a, a a six, then hit to get to a seven. No, sorry. He basically just ended up at ten. So he's right oh, above you. Oh, he's one right oh, above oh, you. I told you. Nice. Oh. Let me let me roll a d4 just to see what the fate would have given me. Oh, my life sucks. <laughs> it would have been a one. Oh, you would have been a one. You would have been a Oh, fuck. You bust Boys and you lose your shit. ten gold pieces. Better luck I next stared. time, baby. Hey, did he bet 100? Drinks now. Yeah, I did. You bet 100? No, I bet 100. All right, mark down on your sheet. Mine is 100 oh, gold. I already, I already, no, I already don't marked that worry, shit. Jay. I shall win you back that and I much use more. one of those drinks. I need one of those drinks. I want to put down 200 right. gold pieces. <laughs> yeah, the waitress comes back, hands you one of the drinks, uh, the lobster cocktail, and you see that she's instantly. got... Oh, instantly? You see that on her, on her dress is a tiny little name tag that just says Karina. Hmm. No worries, darling. You'll get him next time, and then she walks away. I look over at Clorton. I don't understand the value of these, and I dump 200 gold pieces onto the table. <laughs> oh. <laughs> don't understand. You probably... Yeah, never mind. You know what? Would it's I fine. understand the value of mm -hmm. battle? <laughs> and I can ah, yes. Play some fucking blackjack, baby. D6 and a D4. Roll it. Can I cast Guidance on myself, or is that not at all how this works? <laughs> Slide of hand check if you're gonna do that. Oh no, if it's if okay, I wouldn't know it's cheating, so I'm gonna try anyway. <laughs> it is my destiny to get to the ten. <laughs> and I, I uh 
I, I cast Minor Prophecy on myself so I get an added D4, which I don't know what that means in this fucking net all, but I'm going to roll these. <laughs> okay. No, Maybe dude. you have advantage. I don't anyway, know. Anyway, I got one plus one is two. <laughs> you see you see that the, oh. the dealer's D6 in front of you is also a two. So you can choose to hit with a D4 or you can choose to stay. I hit. I hit. I hit. Hit with you a say D4. I hit. I start. I start to. I start to. I put my hand on my on my sword. How do no, I hit? Kind of, what do I hit? No, this. Where do I hit, hit it? Hit, 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 I just like take my hand. No, 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 no. Hit the no, table no, with no, your no. hand. Like knock. Okay. Okay. Don't hit anything. An unarmed. An unarmed whoa, strike. Whoa, then. whoa, whoa, whoa! No need to get physical. Physical. I wish to hit. <laughs> roll a D4. <laughs> you gotta just roll another D4. Oh, Gil, okay. I don't know if gambling Pull is for you. Thing. It seems like you're getting a little. Uh... I got a two. Okay. All right, that brings you up to four total. Uh, but my destiny is to get to ten. <laughs> <laughs> Gonna hit? I look around. May I hit again? Yeah, yeah, do it. <laughs> Multi attack. <laughs> I got a four, eight, right? Yep, that puts you at eight. <laughs> Interesting. Is this good? Yeah, I'd, I'd say that's pretty good. Yeah. Is it the best? No, no not, not, well, the not, best. not the best. Yeah. I roll again. It's pretty good. Oh. <laughs> okay. okay. <laughs> you bust. <laughs> oh, oh. oh. You bust. You rolled a four. It's eight plus Aha! four. You bust. A 12. Uh, what are you doing with, my, with that? <laughs> unfortunately, oh. you pushed your luck too many times again. Uh, and, you, and he reveals to see what he rolled. He actually got up uh, at first. He started at a two, went to a six, and then went to a ten. Raven. Bruh! Clorton, can you do it again one second? I'm just... Hmm? Want me to do it again? Well... Yeah, yeah. I need to see all how right, you do right. it. Okay, okay. Here. I'll just, uh... Yeah, I'll just, uh, bet, like... Okay. I'll bet, I'll bet about 50. You have all about, right. like, 5,000 okay. gold. Our ship will sail <laughs> yeah. much faster and swifter without so much gold. <laughs> you have briefcases yeah. of That's ships nearby. That's a good thing! Yeah, okay. Here, I'll just, I'll just bet 50 for now, you know, just to show you guys what's going yeah, on. Just 50, all right. Yeah, just all right. 50. Sure. Just, just 50. 50. <laughs> all right, all right. There's pain in James. Okay. Eyes. Ah, four. Ah, rats. Okay. Oh. You know what? That's fine. That's fine. I start, like, rubbing Clorton's shoulders. Like, I'm, like, fucking amping him up. <laughs> You've got this, Clorton. Okay. Big okay. numbers. Big numbers. Mm, okay, okay. I'll hit again. Ah. Go ahead. That's, that's a one. That's a, so I have five now. Okay. Okay. You see the dealer uh, hits behind hit. him? Okay, okay. I will Slow hit one steady. more time. You've got it. Oh, okay, that's Isn't a that nine. Eight? That's a nine. Oh, a nine. Is it a nine? Okay. Mm. Very strong. You know what? I'll stay. All right. How does he do it? That's Clorton <laughs> for you, I think. The dealer takes the dice from the, the little counter behind him and then reveals to show that he only managed to stay at an eight, and he shakes his head. God damn it, Clorton. We'll be yeah. here all night. You double your money, and uh, now you yes get 100 gold that back. Clorton. Uh, Please, buddy. Anybody can do that, all right? You're just cool. rolling some dice. <laughs> <laughs> Are you all going to enjoy right. the place? Step aside. Step, aside. Step aside here, Clorton. Here we lose. go. All right. Oh, Jesus, man. I want to I wanna sit down at the table, and I want to look at this blackjack dealer. I want to assess his, his demeanor. I want to roll an inside check. I want to soul read. Okay. You look into his his bulbous fish eyes. <laughs> I look at those bulbs. Uh, I have a minus one, and I just rolled the three, so that's a two. Yeah, Holy it looks shit. like a, he looks like a talking fish to you, and you are you actually <laughs> for a second, you're looking directly at this man, uh, this fish man, this fish head, and then your vision starts to wiggle, and as Chip sits down at the blackjack table, okay. I need everybody to roll a charisma saving throw. Oh fuck! Okay, oh okay. god, I'm awesome at that. Going right really. into it, man. Oh, six. All right. Twelve. Three. Seventeen. <laughs> of course, of course, Gilly. <laughs> <laughs> I eat another lobster. <laughs> I, I don't think you're supposed. Okay. They fueled me. Okay, so oh, yeah. mm -hmm. the three of you, everybody except for Gilliam. No. Suddenly, as uh, as you're staring at this fish man, his features start to wiggle. And then change, and then suddenly you're not looking at a fish man, but a handsome human with a handlebar mustache. Whoa. And you, the three of you, uh, except for Gillian. Gillian, everything for you stays the exact same. <laughs> but you feel... This fish man disturbs me less than a normal human would. <laughs> Very comfortable. <laughs> you feel compelled to stay in the casino and have fun and take risks. You don't want to leave anymore. Risks. 
You're having a ton of fun. You guys feel You know, I suddenly feel like looser. I'm having so much fun and I never want to leave and I just want to spend all my money, every cent of it. And all of the that employees now look normal. I want to I completely agree. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I want I want to lean over and be like, you know, I was thinking this was, you know, looking a little fishy, but not so much no, anymore. He's not fishy at all. Look at him, he's, he's nothing, got a handlebar mustache. Completely normal. Guy. I say is I just look at this big fucking fish guy. <laughs> nothing fishy at all. Nothing fishy. Yeah, Finally no, no. something all right, that let's makes do it. sense. Uh, six and a four? D6, yep, D4. roll a d6 and a d4. Bro, I thought you just said you got a six and let's a four. Let's roll them, baby. Holy shit. Five. All right, five total. You see the dealer rolls yep. out. Much more handsome looking now, a five with a d6. Mm. God. <laughs> He's good. He's good. <laughs> but I'm better. Blow him, baby. Hit. I hold up. I spit on him. All right, D4 would hit. <laughs> Sorry, I get them mixed up sometimes. Okay. No, it's okay. They're well <laughs> lubricated now. That's three, so I'm up to an eight. You're up to an eight. Mm -hmm. Eight. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this is the same impasse that fooled me, Chip. A dealer doesn't budge. What you would know. Chip do? What would you like to do, baby? Stay or hit it again? Be the Chip that will be remembered you know you tomorrow. Normally, normally, I'd stay. Are you Something feeling about lucky? That mustache. It's gotten me feeling lucky. Let's hit it again. Okay. <laughs> Fuck are you talking about? <laughs> ten. <laughs> you get a ten and you win. Oh my god. Wow. The dealer Bring reveals that he stayed at an eight, and you, for the first time since Clorton, have won against the dealer and Black I want to chest bump the nearest person. And start dancing. Okay. Yeah, you can chest bump the nearest person. You start, you chest bump Clorton. Let's go. Yeah, yeah, nice, awesome. Yeah. <laughs> Try that, Clorton. I also chest bump Clorton. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay. Yeah. All right. So Good. all of all of you except for for Gillian are just compelled to go around and and spend how's a bunch Clor of money. How's Clorton's, how's Clorton's chest? Uh, it's it's He's a, a strong intact. guy. Um, yeah, yeah. Strong mm -hmm. guy. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's a good chest you have on your shoulders. A good good uh, shoulder. Thank you. Good thank shoulder. You. Good. <laughs> wait. Okay. Wait. Wait. Let's let's talk to you. Walk let's away and start this. dancing as well. Oh, oh God! There he goes. Okay. <laughs> So what kind of stuff is around here? Yeah, yeah, okay. Mr. Grizzly. As you guys are are, are walking around dancing, there is actually a section. I have my arms section. flat to my side, just wiggling back and forth. Uh, Clorton, uh, do you go with them? Mm -hmm. New people. Uh, One of the first decide... guys you've ever seen win at Blackjack besides you. Mm -hmm. You know what? Yeah, I just I just decided to like finally like peel myself from the chairs and just like, <laughs> like, just, like <laughs> as I like I wanna... just like get up, just like oh, wanna... yep yeah, okay, and I, I grab like put... the two like briefcases and I just kind of walk with them. Yeah, <laughs> that is fucking awesome. I want to put my arm around Clorton and start like telling him how it's done, like <laughs> <laughs> super big shot. Like, see, it's all in the roll of the dice, right? You really just gotta mm -hmm. get the right angle, you know, on mm -hmm. the on the wrist. You know, uh, the angle of the wrist. So like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like this, so this, like, or this. No, 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 no. You want to get? It's so got. That. You gotta have some. Whoosh, you know, uh, you're not. Awesome. You're not doing okay. the. Whoosh, you know what I'm talking about? Ah, oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, Chip I doesn't. Get it one listen, day. He doesn't know what he's talking about. He's never done this before in his life. Yeah, I have significantly more money than him right now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm no, he's honest. he's broke. Hey, I got money. Yeah. <laughs> it's just not here with me right now. I couldn't we, carry it. We took it all of the money from the boat. We have nothing else. It's just so heavy. All the money that I have. That mm -hmm. I can't carry it with me, you know? He's he's lying. I suppose okay. that depends on how weak you are, so yes, maybe. I'm strong. Wait, Chip. you keep your money in a boat? Well, then it is not true. No, oh, I yeah, keep it in a, pirates. in a bank safe. Oh, wait. <laughs> so if you, if, you keep your, if you keep your money in a boat, then I guess you could say it's an onshore account? <laughs> Leave the jokes to me, <laughs> Hey guys, Charlie Slimesicle here. I really hope you guys are enjoying the episode. And can I just say, Ranbu is easily my favorite guest that we've had on this whole campaign. Ranbu's great. Go follow him over on Twitter at Ranbu Says Stuff, YouTube at Ranbu, and of course on Twitch over at Ranbu Live. And of course, you guys know what's coming next. If you're new to the show and you aren't pledged to our Patreon, go check out our Patreon, patreon.com slash just roll with it. We do a just rolled with it after these next episodes with Ranbu where we talk about his character and everything that happened. That's going to be going up 
after the little casino mini arc. We also just released our first Just Roll What If, where we play out a full session of a What If storyline. In this one, it is a version of the Patreon campaign, which there is also one of, where we're fucking superheroes. I play a mystery-solving teen named William Wisp, who has ghost powers. There is so much good content over there. It's produced as well as the show, and just go check it out. You will not regret it, and I put as much into that character as I do Gillian. If you guys like Just Roll With It, you will love fucking Prime Defenders over on Patreon. Go support us over there, because God knows we're going to need it after we gamble all of our money away in the rest of this session. Enjoy, guys. Sip, how much did you bet on the blackjack table again? Uh, I don't think I said anything, so but I yeah, probably yeah. would have just if, if it's the thrown money at it. I don't know. I probably didn't even think about it and just threw money on the <laughs> roll, table. Roll a D100. Let's okay. Find out. Sure. Let's find yeah, out how much. Um, I bet 52 gold. Okay, so you got 104 back. Nice. Yeah, I do. Nice. All right, so as you guys are, are walking around now, uh, Clorton, you've seen a lot of these attractions already. Uh, you guys kind of move through one of the sections, which is built uh, mostly for like a stage of dancing. There's disco, there's a bunch of spot, different colored spotlights, and uh, people dressed very minimally, uh, dancing around, kind of like a mini rave in this part of the casino. And then you go to a different section, which has like amusement part attractions. This area is much taller and bigger than you ever expected it to be from seeing that one side of the ship. But the most interesting uh, like attractions or games that you guys pass by that you can decide from Besides mm -hmm. the, the blackjack that you guys started at. There's a game called Higher Low Tide, um, which is just uh, it's a 10 GP buy-in where you guys can double your money if you win. There's a, uh, a game called Muscle Man, M-U-S-S-E-O, where you, uh, it's a strength test game where you take a hammer <laughs> or a weapon of choice and swing down on a giant muscle clam. <laughs> There's uh, the Riptide Roulette, which is uh, just a normal roulette spinning board. Uh, there's the ship shuffle, which has a dealer who ship uh, an octopus uh, dealer that uh, shuffles six of these like boat containers with a dice under it. That if you guess the right one, uh, you can double your money as well. Oh my God, there's a lot of games in here, oh man. <clears throat> Something that that you that catches your eye as you're walking past it in your state of uh, just everything is normal, Gillian, are the octopus races, where you can bet on one <laughs> of eight <laughs> frogs to buy, or enter your own. I enter my own. Ooh. I go, I go, I go, I go, <laughs> I go. A <Hey>, um, <laughs> holy shit, dude. Yes, Clorton, there is someone mm. that I would like you to meet. Oh, <laughs> who would that be? I would like to gingerly take the little globe I have at my hip. It's full of water, and in it you see this pink frog octopus. It's got the head of a frog. It's got the body of an octopus. Just gently presses up a tentacle. This is pretzel. Ah. Oh. Well, it's nice to meet you. And I just, like, kind of, like, put my finger against the glass, just like... <laughs> Don't go too quickly. <laughs> Quick, she'll ink. You go slow. <laughs> no, no, go slow. <laughs> it's good. It's good. Yeah. Does she like it, DM? <laughs> <laughs> a friend of... A friend of Clorton is... A friend of Pretzel is a friend of mine. Absolutely. Uh, Pretzel senses no danger from Clorton. And That's before, if you know. guys are if you guys are deciding to or if you're deciding to head to the Frogtopus races, uh, the last thing that you guys pass by are just normal, uh, like a slot type machine, but they're called salts. Okay. What can you win from the frog? Can you win a Frogtopus from the Frogtopus race? Yes. I want to try and win <laughs> Galore in the Frogtopus. Let's fucking do it. <laughs> yeah. Fuck yeah. All right. It's, a, it's kind of like a reward choice thing. You can either double your money with uh, your chips that you put into it or the, what you bet on, like who you bet who on. Who the hell cares? Or, of course, you can you can ask for one of the <laughs> one of the, the frog to buy racers. Pretzel is more valuable than all of the all of the currency in, in all the seas. Okay, roll a 1d8 to decide what number uh, Pretzel is going to be. Clorton, do the honors. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. I know Pretzel is number one, but we shall roll this silly die. <laughs> Let us see. Uh, number seven. <laughs> okay, no, but sure. I put Pretzel in number seven. All right. It's this long, uh, almost like a fish tank that is this open, uh, open 
covering. There's no there's no ceiling on it. There's no roof that covers it, or and you just let her in there. And it's like a it looks like an underwater raceway that just goes straight forward for a Holy little bit shit. and then turns. It looks like a racetrack, but underwater and specifically for for swimming. I want to touch. I want to touch pretzel as well. <laughs> Go easy on them, pretzel. You are too powerful for this place. I cast minor prophecy on on her as well. Okay, that gives her a D4. Yeah, and add a D4. Is there anything else? What are the do? other What are the other frog octopus look like? I was just about to say. You see, some pro some one of the frog octopuses has like a, a normal, uh, like a team jersey, just kind of like barely put over the head. Uh, one of them has like a little beanie cap, and then you see some of them actually have like weapons that are just tied oh, to shit. their their tentacles, like small serrated blades. <laughs> Bro, wait, why? It's a race. <laughs> <laughs> it's a race. You know what I do? I uh, let's see. Do race. I have any? Do I have anything? <laughs> Lord, do you have any small weapons? Uh, how how small? Sm <laughs> hypothetically <laughs> small enough like, for a frog to push to hold. Small enough for I, I like I like take out like one of like the toothpick like a like a tiny toothpick from like my like coat and I go like like this. Perfect. I give I give Pretzel okay. a toothpick. I want to. It's an underwater raceway. I want to use shape water to also give her like a just a fucking manner of like weapons made of ice. Like she has like a little goddamn like okay. flail, like a little mace. <laughs> She's a weapon. Pretzel inks just a tiny bit on the tips of her her tentacles and then rubs like a little like Be football lines on her cheeks. <laughs> <laughs> and she furrows her brows in the in the tank. And you hear like a lot. A, a, uh, kind of like a, a small whistle uh, from 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 the, the the person that's overseeing the races, uh, and they take off. While this is happening, what are what are Chip and Jay doing? I'm watching. Do. I'm cheering on like crazy. Okay, yeah, I've I'm never gonna been watch more as well. excited for a small creature. <laughs> All right. Wait, am I allowed to put money on them too? I want to put money on Pretzel. You absolutely can Defeat bet. Defeat those yes. beasts, okay. Pretzel! Yes. It is actually important for me to know if the three of you want to bet on any of the Frogtopus. Okay. It doesn't I have to be Pretzel. I'll bet a hundred on. I'll bet a hundred on pretzel. Okay. Yeah, I know pretzel will win, so I bet all my money on pretzel. Yeah, me too. Oh, 104. It's not even. The, it's not even the something that crosses my mind. I, I bet 300 gold on pretzel. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I. I uh, I'll bet another hundred. Worry not. Fuck this it. is hardly a gamble. Okay. It is destiny. <laughs> Roll a d like just a normal d20 for pretzel. No need to. She'll do it all the what of the minor prophecy? That's plus a D4. Plus four. Fuck it. Got a four. Okay. Ooh. Charlie. Ooh. Shit! Do I add a D4? Yes. Fuck, dude! Oh. Pretzel's gonna die out there! I got an eight. <laughs> okay, that's actually that's you guys actually fine. Help me. You guys gotta help me! That's Please! <laughs> <laughs> what do you want me to do? I don't know what I can pretzel do. Pretzel is pretzel is no, no, cramping. No. You need to give her your energy. It's fine. I kind of just like wave energy. my hand as to like kind of like just like use like wind to blow like yeah. a little bit forward during the race. Just like. <laughs> Uh, please, no interference you hear from the person overseeing the races. You actually see there's it's it's three laps here uh, to win. The first lap, uh, this is what happens with that roll as, the, as they're going by. Uh, you see that that octopus number five goes for uh, goes for pretzel with its it's like no. kind of mini no. chainsaw that is spinning around on its. And then as it like kind of gets closer to to. to to interfere or interrupt Pretzel's movement and go for an attack, it misses completely. And with the icicle that Pretzel has, uh, she slashes towards it, and it gets knocked out of the race as it gets knocked unconscious and does a few backflips back, and then just floats yes! to the surface. Uh, and then she goes. She doesn't make it first. Uh, she's actually right now, since there's eight racers, she's about in sixth place for this first lap. Uh, go ahead and roll another d20 for the second lap. Okay, I would like to. I would like to. Uh... <laughs> If, if attack is not what we want, then perhaps speed. I would like to rework this, these ice shapings. I would like to create uh, an, an ice propeller. <laughs> okay. <laughs> roll a d20 with an advantage. I'll say it happens. <laughs> speed her up. All right, rolling two d20s. Okay. Uh, it's a 16 plus right. a d4 is an 18 for pretzel. Okay. Yeah. That's perfect. I'm, I'm so more invested in this than whatever the hell this main plot fucking is. <laughs> the yeah, second this? lap <laughs> is a huge improvement. You see Pretzel, uh, the, the the weapons just form into these these circular rocket boosters on the back of all eight of, or no, four, three, right? 
Three or four. How many tentacles? Four, four, four. tentacles. Four. And it just propels her forward. She boots past yes, the competition special. and actually gets put into second we have place. We've done this before. Second place who's on the, the second who's the lap. the bastard in first? Number one. Which bastard <sighs> frogtopus is this? And it's just a frogtopus with a little beanie cap. No weapons. Okay, I can respect that. I can actually respect that. <laughs> All right. I'm just like screaming at the top of my lungs like, Go Pretzel! Woo! Yeah! Like Woo! way too loud for this place. You know what yeah. I do? You know what I do? She's still got the jet turbines. <laughs> I didn't think I'd have to do this. I reach into my pocket. I pull out a pretzel and break <laughs> off a piece. And I throw <laughs> it in her path so that she'll eat it. Roll another d20 with an advantage. I'm just Jesus watching this, like having no idea what any of this means. Haven't needed to do means. this in a long time. Oh my god. Okay, I got a 19 plus. Okay, one, so 20. Before any, before any, before the plus 20 that Pretzel has to exist. I feel on, like a fucking crack addict right on now. On the third <laughs> lap, this number one and number seven, Pretzel and another Frogtopus that's green in color with the little beanie cap, they are neck and neck. And as you throw that Pretzel in front of her, she immediately lights up with this crackhead expression. Her eyes yes, go pretzel. wide and she zooms past him. But for some reason, uh, the, 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 the number one, puts its tentacles in like a spear shape and starts to spin rapidly no. as if becoming a torpedo no. and then it boosts forward no, no. and right as Pretzel is about to cross the finish no! line no. you see a green blur no! zoom past her how'd you get above a fucking 20 out of the 20 no! roll you sick I rolled fuck. a natural 20 for him what? <laughs> I break this, down this on the ground this place is rigged How? I just I just, I just... I'm in shambles. I'm in shambles. Winner! Coral, the green frog to push! And uh, as your runner-up prize, you don't lose any money, but you do not uh, uh, gain a frog to push or, or double anything. Any of your bets. No. So whatever you guys bet, uh, you do lose that. Oh, we lost what we bet? Yes. Losing all my money. Wait, everyone or just... <laughs> everyone that bet. <laughs> So I, everything I bet is gone. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Okay, I, I did bet all my money on that. So. <laughs> <sighs> wait, did you, oh, wait, I'm confused. Shit. Did you say I don't lose it or I do lose it? No, you, you do, do lose the money. You do lose whatever okay, you cool, bet cool, on. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Uh, <laughs> and, take and, it all. I want to go to the fucking one where it's like the the, the ball under the the cups. Yeah. That one. Yeah, yeah I want to do that one. You can do that. That feels less like gambling and more like. Perception based. <laughs> yeah. Okay, no, I've had enough of this. I'm not losing any more. I've had enough to hear. You! I hate this. I hate give me all place. your money! <laughs> I'm just I'm like just consoling evil. Gil, just like That's <laughs> right. I'm full of a deep evil. <laughs> I mean Close. I only lost like a hundred gold. I still have so much more, so I'm pretty much indifferent, but there, there. not <laughs> the only thing we have lost today. <laughs> <laughs> I I don't know what else you lost besides gold, honestly. <laughs> Pretzel, come back to me. Worry not. My frog to push there will be a reckoning. <laughs> okay. You, uh... So, Jay, you walk up yeah. to the octopus uh, uh, operator who has, you know... Uh, who's... Uh, what's he who's look using... like in human form? He's clearly human to me. Okay. <laughs> right. So... Mm -hmm. Still a man with uh, eight arms. Holy shit. Except it just looks like to you at the moment, he's whenever he moves his arms, it, it almost like after images for mm, your vision okay. at the moment. And with your uh, distorted vision, whatever you do here will probably be at disadvantage. Oh, are you kidding me? I'm distorted vision? Oh. Oh, that's rough. Okay, yeah, fuck it. I trust my, I trust my vision. Okay. <laughs> All right, so uh, I throw all my money on the table. You get up there, and the operator just invites you to uh, to, to play the game. Uh, what you? Mm -hmm. How much money did you put on? Wait, all of it? All of it. I'm all of it. It's <laughs> Dude, all going in. So stupid. <laughs> okay. Oh my God. Yeah, I, I feel I feel inclined to. I just feel so. <laughs> Roll a perception check at disadvantage. Mm, yeah. Okay. Are we about I'm to lose all just, of our money at a I'm casino? I'm just sobbing. Every I'm just sobbing, us. feeding it's both Gordon and thing. Pretzel all these fucking pretzels. <laughs> Mm, so I got a 10 both times. All right, so 
you see the dice go under a uh, boat boat covering number one. I close I close my eyes, <laughs> and, miss it completely. And, I'm uh, like, oh wait. <laughs> the operator starts moving the hands rapidly. It looks like he has fucking eight arms, like with the, one of that god with the you know the all of the arms. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm talking about. Anyways, so he just moves yeah, yeah. it extremely fast, and then it stops, and a little bit of dust just kind of uh, blows off the table. Uh, which one? You can still guess. Number five. He lifts up number five. And there's no dice. Oh, no dice. Would you like to try again? Do you just lose all your money? <laughs> yeah, I have nothing. <laughs> Chip, Chip and Clorton, is there anything you guys want to do? <laughs> um, there is something I want to do, but you can go ahead first if you have something. Clorton is my battle brother now. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I'm gonna I'm gonna go over to the um to the muscle one. I'm gonna go over and play walk the over. play Ooh, the muscle, muscle man. Walk all over, right, I walk over yeah. sadly with him. Yeah, I kind of just I kind of just like have my hand around, just like it's consoling good. him it's still fine. about his loss. We're like okay, okay. I'll, I'll... It's okay, it's okay. fine. <laughs> it's right. a it's a five GP so buy-in minimum, me. but you can bet mm, more. Okay, I'll bet I'll bet uh you know what I'll bet five hundred on this. Oh, oh my shit. god! All right. All right. Uh, you pick up the hammer and it is a it is a strength check. You're gonna fucking win, it's you guest episode, check. motherfucker. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. I roll. I, 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 16. I, here, I'm gonna, I wanna casually just give him a little shoulder rub. I'm not very enthused about it. I'm gonna cast guidance on him anyway. <laughs> there, you've got this, or whatever. Okay, okay. Add a d4, add a d4 to it. Add a d4, okay, so add that's a d4, 16, yeah. and then roll d4. 17. Okay. Uh, for this first one, when you bet 500 gold, you raise it all the way up, comes slamming down on the shell, but the shell does not crack and the bell does not ring. As you see, it just barely miss, just barely get to the top and then fall back mm. down. What is this place? It's, uh, no, it's okay, it's okay. You know what You know what my strategy is? Whenever you lose, double your bet. I'm gonna do it again, but with a thousand. <laughs> okay, so that would be <laughs> minus 1,500 Holy to shit. your 5,000 gold. <laughs> okay, okay. Go ahead, roll again. Uh, same right, same D4. Right. You can still add a okay, D4. Okay, okay. All right, all right. Add a D4. Let's do this. That's a 13 this you time. You could be the hero we could not. Oh, right. Okay, yeah. No. Unfortunately, this goes even lower the second time. <laughs> the shell still does not burst. Okay, okay. It's you a know tough what, shell. You know what they... You know what they say? Every time you lose, <laughs> double your bet. I'm gonna That's bet what you two thousand. Time and then wait, hold on. <laughs> okay. No, don't worry. I'm gonna bet two thousand gold this time. Mine is two thousand right. five hundred. You're about half broke now. Okay. Well, Go would ahead. it be minus three thousand five hundred? Because I bet yeah. five hundred, then a thousand, then two thousand. I want it. Can I? Can I? Can okay. I? Like, I'm behind him. I've been rubbing his shoulders. I want to like put my hands on the hammer as well. We need to strike it as one, Clorton. You can roll yes, at advantage I'm... if you do it that way. I'll allow it for right, you. Right. they're allowing that. <laughs> there's nobody. Okay, there's nobody okay. supervising this particular game. So what oh, I do? Wow. Would I do two d20s and two d4s, or just two d20s and a four? I think it's just two d20s and a four. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Pick the highest d20 and add the four. Oh, I am so. I want you wow. to get this so bad, man. That's why. I'm that is a. <laughs> that is a. That is a fourteen. <laughs> It still oh, doesn't no. crack. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you know what they say. Each time you lose, and then I look over, realize that I have nothing to double on my bet. Okay, I'm gonna get. I'm gonna bet fifteen hundred this time. But I thought that every time you lose, you. No, it's, Holy I, shit! It, it's just all part of the strategy. It's lose just all money. part of the strategy. Okay. Martin. This oh. is your destiny. I get ready. I you, you start to see the fucking like the hammer start to glow. I'm ready to fucking smite this thing. I'm okay. gonna smite okay. the button. Okay. <laughs> All right. All right. So two d20s and a four. Wait, the prophecy guide okay. us, Clorton. Let's do this thing. Okay. Okay. Wait. Thirteen plus two, and then oh. plus four. So that's a nineteen. Wait. No. Besides wait. The, the strength. Back, right? Wait, wait, wait. Which was the oh, highest? Wait, yeah. Is it with strength? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Plus yeah, strength. 13 was the highest. Okay, okay. Yeah. 
All right. I just happened to roll a, a four on the other D20. A 19 total? Mm-hmm. I smite it! What do you, how do you smite it? <laughs> I, I use, I use to find smite when I'm holding his hands and I, I'm gonna, bam, <laughs> kill this, I wanna kill it. It's evil, this place is evil. Pretzel's okay. just in a cloud of black. Is that a roll to hit? You've turned pretzel sweetheart dark. <laughs> can we, can we fucking your, you? your, your, your bow at the hip is just black water. You can't even see pretzel no, at it's the a, moment. It's a, if I hit, I can activate divine smite and it does extra damage. Um, okay, what is the what is the what is the damage? Oh, the extra damage to the hit. Or is, if you roll the hit, yeah. Uh, well, it's yeah. So usually it's when you hit with a weapon attack, and mm -hmm. it is going to be um two d eight extra damage. Assuming that we are trying to kill this button and not participate in the game. <laughs> <laughs> you you roll to hit. Not a strength oh, check, to, okay, just roll sick, to hit. Sick, sick. Just with strength? Yeah. Sure. 12 to hit a button. Okay, roll the damage. Oh, thank God. <laughs> 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 All right. Uh, 2d8 for the smite. Okay, I got a 6 and an 8, so 14 <laughs> radiant damage. Clorton. <laughs> Cl sorry, Clorn. <laughs> Clorn, you, you see, uh, you see that the hammer, as you strike it, the bell goes up only halfway before electricity comes from. <laughs> as his hair raises and his eyes glow, electricity surrounds uh, the the hammer and then enters the shell. The entire machine bursts into a, a glittering gold of pieces. Yes. <laughs> and you just hear shit, 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 shell, shell. As the fucking machine is now broken. <laughs> <laughs> I told you this place would not best us. Did, did I did I win or what, what what happened? There's just a bunch of chips spilling out of the side. Oh, I'm just I'm just going. <laughs> okay, just right here. Okay, I just gotta pick up just all the ones that I can find. Like there are <laughs> people like... that are like coming in, just like, hey, nope, nope, nope mine. <laughs> I won yeah, this. J Jay's, in sure. Jay's in there. Jay's in there too. I'll, She's I'll trying to grab. Him. I'll help him pack them all up. <laughs> all right, all right. Uh, I'll get to that chip. What do you? What did you want to do? Okay, so the uh, the frog to push that won. I want to. I want to identify the owner of this frog to push. You motherfucker. I want, I want to see who. Why am I? I'm, I'm what? You bastard. What are you gonna do? So what you are you gonna are. do? What are you gonna do? What do you think I'm gonna do? I'm gonna steal. You're gonna steal his Primus? Holy shit! Yeah! What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> I'm gonna catch uh, me a winner. You see, That's whenever. So fucked up, man. <laughs> you are when... a bastard. <laughs> whenever, so whenever they walk away sad to go participate in other games, you look up and you see the person that is, um, the person that is lifting up their Froctopus, the green Froctopus coral, out of the water is this beautiful woman with dark, long hair and glistening emerald eyes in this green sparkling dress. She just pats and she just, you just hear her whisper, good job. And then she takes her sack of cash and starts to walk away. Or her, her briefcase of chips, I should say. I start to just fucking follow behind. This is horrifying. Like, <laughs> it's horrifying. And I wanna, I wanna um, like move up right behind her. Oh uh, hey, uh, excuse me, ma'am. How how are you uh, doing to, oh. today? Well, I finally won the race, so I'm doing pretty good. Yeah, I saw that back there. That was pretty cool. Could I see that little guy? He's cool. cool oh, guy. This is got... just like a child to me. I would never hand him over to a stranger. <laughs> oh, of course, of course not. Of course not. Of course not. Uh, so do you um you come here often? I've been here for a while. You been a while. Mm. Mm. Uh, about how long? How long you been? <laughs> Maybe a few hours at most. Are you having yeah. a good time? Yeah, yeah. Can't complain. Can't complain. Lost all my money. Yeah. I got more though. So much more. It's a lot. Oh, I keep see. it in the. Keep it in my ship. It's called the Millennium Chipper. Yeah, big deal. She Not. kind of uh, rubs. <laughs> she lifts her hand towards your collar and just kind of fixes it and gently runs it down the shirt and then says. You want to help me gamble this money away? Yes. Okay. I want to do that. <laughs> I want to do that with you. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, this, uh, this woman takes you to uh, Riptide Roulette. All right. And uh, 
How much should we bet? All of it. <laughs> All of it, sweetheart. <laughs> every, every. <laughs> what is this? Throw it High in. risk or low risk? You know what I say? I say we risk it all tonight. What the fuck? <laughs> she uh, she kind of uh, sighs heavy or not sighs, but li- exhales heavily, and then uh, puts this giant briefcase on the table uh, and and asks to, to do the high risks uh, bet. Basically, what? Mm-hmm. choose a number between one or tw- one and twenty. Oh Jesus, man, you're so Seven. bad. <laughs> so fucked. <laughs> Why? What the fuck happened? What did I do? What did I do? I've been swindled. I've been swindled. You made all these. Tra- you went in there to steal something, and you just ended up getting robbed. <laughs> <laughs> I threw all my. Uh, she had, all of my gold was sent, and like whatever she was betting on, I put it all in. Mm-hmm. The rest Riz, of I look, it. I, I look lost over. So much. I look over. Who is it? What does this woman actually look like? That's accompanying Chip. Give me one second. <laughs> what did you roll? Curious. Wait, I, I roll? I thought you said choose. Oh, sorry. What did you choose? My bad. Seven. Okay. Lucky number. We'll see. A metal ball <laughs> rolls down uh, a track that uh, enters the, the roulette as, as the wheel as it's spinning, and you just hear click, 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 as it's, as it's going uh, across all the different slots and numbers, uh, and you see it land in a black 18. I didn't. I'm not paying attention. I'm just looking at it. <laughs> I'm just and like hear, smiling too big. Like, as this happens, uh, I need the three of you. Sorry, yeah, three of you. Three to roll uh, um, another charisma saving throw. This time with advantage, having when lost all th- of your. When money. you say three, do you mean the ones who? who everybody who got. Yeah, yeah. The ones who, two who got. Oh, uh, intoxicated. Uh, twenty-one. Okay. Oh, wow. 19. Excellent. Good stuff, guys. Excellent. You failed your saves the first time, and I'm still like, I'm like <laughs> fucking more insane. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. As this uh, ball Why rolls you... into a number where you lose, you hear, <gasps> No! And you look to your right, and instead of this beautiful woman, it is a, 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 a large black eel head that looks at you angrily as you have just bet all of its money away still in the same humanoid uh, uh, body and dress. That Clorton <laughs> ship caught himself Jay. a good one. Jay, oh, you feel yourself oh, what the heck? sitting in front of uh, 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 the man who seemed to have eight arms that becomes an octopus and you come back to your senses uh, and, and then Clorton, for the first time in what feels like hours and hours of, of being in here, you finally realize that you have been held here almost intox from the drink controlled to want to stay you know what because they for say the first time you, you feel a sense Clorton. of wanting to leave well, what do they say they say you double it ah uh, well uh, i don't know how much i really won from picking up all these chips but uh, w- what's going on why are there why are there so many fish heads around here now <laughs> put my hand on the shoulder hmm? this is all completely normal Clorton. <laughs> this is normal are, <laughs> Uh, uh, oh, and we okay, I mean. are winning. I or, I walk back okay. towards Gil and Clorton. Well, as hey, you Gil. as you're walking uh, as you're walking towards them, uh, Chip, you are now standing uh, by this um, sea horror, looking at you angrily. Uh, the oh, f- and you guys reunite. I jumped. I'm hiding behind like a like a fucking stool or something. Then like uh, then you trembling. would notice as Jay is reuniting with uh, Gillian and Clorton as they're by this broken machine shoveling all the chips into briefcases there's these uh big muscular humanoids with the shark heads uh, holding their earpieces and saying things like we've got woe customers and they've destroyed the machine restrain them quickly as they're like almost kind of beelining straight towards uh uh the, the your group of friends and then you guys right. turn as uh, as as court as you notice all of these fish heads around you you see those those shark <laughs> Mer sharks, kind of uh, coming straight towards you guys, and you know that these are like the guards, the bouncers. Mm-hmm. Um, uh, do I? They think they can stop us from going again, <laughs> Clorton. I, I think, I think they can actually. Um, we should probably uh, get out, maybe get out of here, run, just run away. I wonder, hey, Gil. 
Do you think Chip would mind if we sold the a ship? A hero like, never I ran runs out of money. Clorton, and I have a gambling addiction. <laughs> oh, um, I mean, oh actually, you know what? Me too, but I mean, I prefer to not be... Oh, they are, they are approaching quickly. Oh, they are actually. right uh, there. Probably. So if they're coming, yeah, would I are. see them coming? Yes. You can find me pretty much anywhere under the name Rombu, twitch.tv forward slash Rombu live or youtube.com forward slash Rombu. Uh, I do daily streams, just kind of just messing around. You probably see me on the Dream SMP and all that, and yeah. What's this? A list of the casino's high rollers. The most successful gamblers ever in the Blue Royale Casino. Let's see who's in here. The big motherfucking cheese. He seems to have earned a lot of cheddar. Cake Vape Master 69 who obscured his cards from the house by using fat clouds. Cat Aesthetic is a name on here. They are barred from the casino. No pets are allowed. Seal, the rat connoisseur. Do they have thumbs, Seal? Tell me, Seal! Do they have thumbs? <clears throat> Cornier Comet is also on here. The Gambler from the Stars. Creepy Reaper. I have heard the rumors of this undead swindler, Edgy Moss. Oh yes, I have seen her artwork around the casino. You know, Yaloon. It says here they were able to walk away with, wow, 50,000 gold pieces. I know not what that means or how much it is. Good job. Gillian's biggest fan. Is there, is there another Gillian in here? I have a fan. <laughs> I, Gillian Ty Strider, am a hero. And you too will be one one day. Indy Mindy 9 says here she won 9,000 gold but traded it all for sticky hands at the counter on the way out. Excellent investment. Jay Newell got 14 full houses in a row. Incredible management of real estate, Jay. J-R-W-I Enjoyer. <laughs> I enjoy when I get to hit villains with my sword. Jumpiest Venus 34 was blacklisted at the casino as the snake who kept rolling snake eyes. That's cool. King of Ranch says here he put the casino out of money for a week. And of course, out of ranch for a month. Kirby Wafro says here you are excellent at games of strategy and won them repeatedly. I'd like to take you in chess. Non-Axolotl says here they were an axolotl that won, well, quite a lotl. Old Man Skeletal, don't trust him and his bone dice. And his actual bones. Reshi Sniffy walked away with a frivolous three milli. Riker Kurotu, he robbed the house and now they want to know where he go to. Salutatien. They roll the die and then say goodbye. Serene is actually a skele- How many ske- how many skeletons are in- I do not fear undead, but how many are skeletons in this casino? Viridan. They just keep winning again and again. Your gal pal, Valerie V. Shows here the V actually stands for very much money. Well, these people are indeed impressive in their accolades. And you could be as well if you head over to patreon.com slash just roll with it. Hold on, ship is trying to gamble my bird. Stop!